Welcome to Investing in Cryptocurrency, brought to you by Cryptovice.com. Hello and welcome to Investing in Cryptocurrency. Today on the docket, we've got our obligatory PR announcements. After that, we're going to talk about a Bitcoin and cryptocurrency super conference that's happening in Dallas, Texas in February of 2018. You don't want to miss it. And we've got a 10% discount code for you. After that, we're going to review our call that we made on the Lumen coin in the last video that we posted about 10 days ago. And then we'll wrap it up with the stock picks that you can make to indirectly get involved into cryptocurrency. So with that being said, here is the obligatory PR. We are online at www.cryptovice.com. You can also follow us on Twitter at CryptoVice1. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We've got about 550 subscribers now. We're heading towards that 1,000 subscriber milestone. And when we reach that milestone, we'll be able to do live videos with interactive chat. And uh, we're looking forward to that. So with that, let's talk about this Bitcoin Super Conference that's happening February 16th through the 18th, 2018. And if you're looking for a conference of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency, then look no further. Go to their website at bitcoinsuperconference.com. It looks like this. You can check out their speakers, their sponsors, the exhibitors. It's a fun-filled, action-packed, informative three-day event in Dallas, Texas that is going to be talking about everything crypto. And yours truly will be there as well. We're going to be talking about physical Bitcoin. We're going to be showcasing some of uh, physical Bitcoin that we have access to. And there will be some giveaways, not just coins, but also the Encyclopedia of Physical Bitcoins and Cryptocurrency, a book by Elias Ahonen is going to be uh, given away as well. So if you want to register, go to bitcoinsuperconference.com, click on the register here button, and you'll be taken to this screen. You can reserve your spot. It is $600, but that is the price only until the end of October. Just for being a subscriber and a listener to CryptoVice, you can get a 10% discount by typing in all lowercase CryptoVice. 39 and you'll get 10% off which brings the price down to 537 so go online use the discount check it out if you're interested it's a great event it's going to have a lot of great speakers and great information now before we get into the stock market i want to do a status report because the last video that we did and there's many other videos that that prove this as well but the last video we did was on the lumen coin specifically surrounding stellar the company behind it the people etc that video was posted about 11 days ago which today it is uh October 17th, the video was posted right around uh, Friday the 6th, which puts us right here. Now, if you recall in the video, there was a little bit of a spike because of the ICO, the ICO decks. There was a conference. Um, there was a lot of great news and momentum. And the coin increased pretty exponentially, uh, pretty significantly in the following days. But I, I did recommend that you just kind of cool it. You let things go as they may. Um, and the buy point would be right around 325 to 375, depending on your uh, propensity to risk. And as you can see in the subsequent week, the coin adjusted itself to get right back down to the mid 300s or so in that 325 to 375 uh, range. And then the news of IBM came out and it shot up to 1000 um, and is now settled right about 750 to 800. So if you had watched our video in the last week or so, uh, took the recommendation, not to say you should take all of our recommendations, but I like to give credit where credit's due. And if you had taken the re recommendation of buying in the range of 325 to 375, you would be sitting at a two times profit. Now it's up to you if you want to realize that profit and sell the coin. Might be a good strategy to take some profit off the table. Maybe not your entire stake, but perhaps just enough to realize some gains. But nonetheless, I just wanted to call that out because a lot of times people are quick to call out the failures, but not necessarily uh, very quick to call out the wins. So let's talk about these two two stocks that if you are interested in Bitcoin and you're interested in cryptocurrency, you think it might have some some legs, may have some runway. There are two companies that you can consider if you want to invest in Bitcoin or cryptocurrency in general indirectly. You're not quite ready to make the leap and buy the coins uh, as they are. You're not quite ready to invest in mining, whether that's cloud mining or putting up a rack in your, uh, in your garage, but you want to get involved. And here's the way to do it. If you want to have some skin in the game uh, and you want to do it easily through the stock market, two stocks can, can do that for you. 
One is Advanced Micro Devices, AMD. The other is NVIDIA Corporation. And you may wonder why are these two stocks a potential uh, consideration for investment? Now, I'm not saying go out and invest. I'm just saying this could be uh, a way to invest in cryptocurrency indirectly. If you talk about uh, Bitcoin and the mining that is required to get Bitcoin, there's a massive demand for getting all the different components to create a miner. And a miner is the computer that uh, confirms the algorithms and confirms the transactions and is then rewarded with Bitcoin. Because the complexity of Bitcoin mining is, is becoming more difficult, the computers are becoming more advanced. Years ago, you could invest in a laptop and mine Bitcoin through that laptop. Now you need a much more advanced computer and with those advanced computers comes more advanced components. Who makes those components? NVIDIA. And I'm not going to read this article, but you can do research on it yourself. But as you can see, Intel, Advanced Micro, all these uh, chip makers are vying for that market share to create the more advanced components, uh, graphics cards specifically, that were, are required for mining Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies as well. Because cryptocurrency has really shot up in, in interest and uh, marketability and value, People are looking for ways to mine it, and mining it requires advanced computers, which requires advanced components, which are made by NVIDIA, Intel, and advanced micro devices. So these are chip companies with, that a lot of analysts are saying have good tailwinds because not only are they providing the chips for the, our cell phones, cars, gaming, and all the other technology-driven devices, but now they're building the components for mining that has become one of the biggest and highest growing industries uh, in technology. So for those of you who are intrigued by cryptocurrency and by Bitcoin, but you're not willing to invest in the coin itself or in the industry, this is a way to retain your stock market approach and still indirectly uh, reap the rewards that are coming out of the cryptocurrency industry. So as I say before the end of every video, you've got to do your own research, make your own decisions, but these are some considerations to make if you want to indirectly get into the cryptocurrency market. NVIDIA and AMD seem to get the most press, but there are other chip companies like Micron, Microchip, Qualcomm, Intel. Um, do some research, do some searches, and see which companies would be the best fit for your portfolio uh, and whether they are attacking this market that seems to be ripe for the picking. So that's all I've got. Like this video and share it so we know you're not a robot. If you're listening on Podomatic, subscribe to our channel on YouTube and check us out on Twitter at CryptoVice1. We also have a website, www.cryptovice.com. And if you are so inclined, you can shoot us a note at CryptoVice at gmail.com. Thanks again for listening and watching, and we'll be back for more cryptocurrency perspective, analysis, and advice.